All right, so we're here in New Mexico for Michelle's archery elk hunt. And as a base camp tent, we've been using the Argali six person cellway. So this is a six person teepee. We have it set up in base camp mode for Michelle and I. And it's got about six foot three of height, which is nice for me getting dressed in the mornings. But I'll show you a little bit on the inside here. Um, you got a guy out point on every corner which is nice if you really want to maximize your space inside. Um, for the two of us, that hasn't been important. But you got dual entry doors. Um, everything is reinforced around the zippers and the seams. And open up the door here. And the way we have this set up for base camp, like I said, is all of our gear, our clothing, boots, shoes, all on this side of the tent here and we have a floor insert for this half so we got all of our clothing we got a tote there um, boots extra things and then you can see we've got a half insert in our sleeping side so there's really bad mosquitoes um, chiggers all kinds of stuff here in new mexico that we don't want to sleep with um, so we've got this half insert in uh, really neat connection for the insert connects to the teepee super easy very adjustable to get it exactly where you want um, and then you got a center entry point here into your sleeping quarters just bring the zipper up and as I mentioned this is for Michelle and I and we've got two lightweight Helinox style cots sleeping bags pillows and plenty of room in between um, to get dressed all kinds of stuff so just gives you a lot of space very nice base camp setup of course you got a stove jack up top and just an outstanding option um, if you want to do a real comfy base camp like this or um, if you want to fit multiple guys in here in a backpacking style uh, with a stove for late season um, you could easily fit four guys lined up on that side of the pole um, with normal sleeping bags running your stove set up over here and all your gear on the side so just ton of room it's been a great setup here in New Mexico and looking forward to using it a little more and getting it on some later season hunts as well